Welcome to you, everybody. Day 12. Day 12 of our Chonky Trundler uh, Camino Portuguese. Now, we were actually going to record this at the hostel we were at, but this morning they had a bit of a power issue, so our shutters were down and there were no light. We couldn't in the open room. the shutters, it was like pitch black inside <laughs> yeah. the room. So we're on the Camino. Camino, Camino yeah, we're just, we're just uh, about a kilometer or so down the road. Have had our lovely breakfast. Yeah and uh, the weather is looking pretty decent. A bit squinty for me. A bit squinty, maybe a bit, <laughs> bit bright, but yeah. all in all, fantastic. Yeah. Um, however, tomorrow is going to be torrential, apparently, but we'll see. Well, we have a rest day planned, so yay. Yeah, today is a very short day, even for chunky uh, for Chunky trundlers. Chunky trundlers. Chunky trundlers. <laughs> I'm still tired from yesterday. <laughs> even for chunky trundlers, it's a short day. It should only be about six kilometers or so. It'll end up being 50, because that always happens. I don't know what happens to us. I think it's just wandering around looking for food aimlessly. Uh, makes every day about 15 kilometers. But that's not what we aim for no. today. So today should be a very short day. I think it's something really short, about six or so kilometers. We're almost one and a half in already. So. Yeah, oh. we're just gonna, um, we're going from Villa de Praia Ancora, Ancora mm -hmm. to Melido, uh, where we've got uh, a little apartment booked in Airbnb for two days, do our laundry, get sorted out and basically prepare for Spain. Yeah. Um, because then on Friday we will be hitting Spain, yep. which we're super excited about. Yeah. Uh, sad to believe in Portugal. It's um, been epic, but we'll wrap it up a little bit when we uh, yeah. So take it over. Um, should be a nice, easy, short day. Um, I don't know how much filming will be, but we'll certainly do some for sure, just to show you the route. Maybe we'll show you a lot of the laundry going around the washing machine yeah, to fill the yeah, time. That's more likely. <laughs> um, but it, it should be a really nice route. We're going to be walking along the coast for all those six kilometers. Yes. <laughs> so, we'll take you along with us. Have a great day, take good care. We'll catch you later. Bye. Bye. No wonder they like surfing here. We kind of want to try it, except, you know, so there. Yeah. Beautiful though. sort of rectangular field things. I don't know how well you can see them. I'm not really sure what they're for. If anybody knows, let us know. They seem a little bit too rock filled for planting anything. The sheep would just clear that. Anyway, they uh, certainly add to the scenery. See you later.
everybody. So, Same. there we go. That's our first proper view. You can see it. I think that's like Guada, yeah. I think it's called. Anyway, well, goodbye so, Portugal tomorrow. Well, yeah. day after tomorrow. Friday, yeah. Friday. Okay, we're nearly there actually, and then we're going to do our laundry and have a chill and get some videos done. That'll be good. See you soon, everyone. Bye. Bye. everybody well that's actually the end of day 12 for us um, even by chunky standards <laughs> it was a very small day uh, it took <laughs> us even uh, our little speed trundle speed with it, filming it, and playing with, with the drone it took us less than two hours it we was had glorious a leisurely breakfast um, in Villa de Praia Caraco? I know wherever it was we'll put it up there Ding. um akura yes and then we just basically trundled up the coast um in the was, sunshine it was beautiful yeah it was nice uh i mean look at the weather today it's it's fantastic i wish it would last remember this because in tomorrow's video you will see 180 degree change um, <laughs> Biblical, isn't it? And how many millimeters of rain? Well, they keep changing their minds, but it's definitely going to rain a lot. tomorrow. But, it's uh, going to be a lot. We will uh, show you this view with some rain. Yeah. Um, oh, it's the sea behind us, I think. Yes, yes. we are staying uh, in a little town called Melido, which is uh, only a couple of kilometers away from Camina, um, which is where most people go and then they either continue up uh, the, the river if they're going to do the coastal route or they take the yeah, yeah. Tui and around that way or they take the littoral which is what we're going to do so somehow we need to find a boat across or we'll have to swim but hopefully we'll find a boat hopefully a boat uh, we've got to be in tomorrow to find boats but most of the boats are not running yet no um, it's an after easter kind of thing yeah. so hopefully we'll make it they're supposed to be at least one ferry a day at eight o'clock but we're yeah. a little bit away from it which we didn't know when we chose this place no so hopefully we'll either find a private boat taxi or we'll just have to get up somewhere. oh we'll do something yeah. we've got all day tomorrow to pick it up yep and we'll let you know um t the date today is the 6th of march uh and at least two that i spoke to said that starting from next week yes. they will be doing multiple trips a day fine but of course that doesn't help us on no, friday it does not. so we'll let you know how we get on um don't think there was anything. I mean, we, we were only walking for two hours, so not much happened. No, and we went to a little mini market and did shopping for tomorrow, and there's a pizzeria right around the corner, so dinner's kind of sorted there. Yeah, we're just going to hibernate tomorrow. Oh, it has a washing machine, so next part of the laundry. Yeah, that's definitely needed doing. I've, yes. I've, I've run out of everything now. Everything's gone. Uh, tomorrow will be shorts and my <laughs> spare. Uh, base layer, <laughs> that's that. Yeah. So, uh, I think that's everything that we can tell you about today. Okay. Um, this flat has a bathtub, which our saw legs are sorely looking forward to. Yeah, we're actually, this is our first Airbnb of the uh, of the Camino. Yeah. Um, everything else has been hostels and private uh, albergues and things along the way. I'll put a couple of hotels actually. Yeah. But uh, this time we've got an Airbnb, which is lovely. Mm. Um, 
for the rest of today and tomorrow. So we're gonna have baths, rest our legs, ready Weary for legs. striding into Spain on Friday. Yeah. So that's it everybody, take good care. We'll see you tomorrow, take care, bye. Hey everyone, um, well today is day 13. Day 13 <laughs> actually turned out to be lucky for some because today the weather has been crazy. Um, we've had what? Lots of rain. Yep, yeah, lots of heavy rain. There's thundering at the moment. Thunderstorm, yeah, actually at the moment. Hail, yeah. sunshine, oh yeah, and wind. But we've been inside because it's a recipe. Yeah, so none of those matters when you're sitting on the sofa eating <laughs> cookies, uh, drinking coffee and watching The Mandalorian. Yeah, it was very good. Uh, <laughs> that's, that's been the extent of our exciting uh, rest day. Mm. But all the laundry's done. We've had a very chilled time. It's been so nice. Yeah, uh, it's been fantastic really. Just to really chill and watch telly for the first time in several weeks. Yeah. So, um, Looking all, at all our crazy views on YouTube, my, you're going crazy people, thank we've you. We've had over a thousand views, <laughs> that's... That's staggering. Absolutely mind-blowing to I think, think that, that would ever happen. A thousand views, the, 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 the YouTube genuinely <laughs> did start off as, uh, as a, uh, a video blog really just for oh, us. Just for us, so a thank diary. you, I'm glad you like it, um, I hope you like it. <laughs> And then we, you know, friends and family seeing it and following along, that was one thing. But to have... Strangers saying we're doing good. People watching, <coughs> people from all around the world watching it is just mind-blowing to yeah. us. Uh, so thank you so much uh, for the wonderful comments, the encouragement and the help. Yeah. Um, we've been asking questions. Because we're new to this, you know, we're not adventurers, we're, we're new to this. This yeah. is our first big walk. So we're just feeling our way up the coast of Portugal. Tomorrow is a super exciting day for us um, because we will cross into Spain. Yeah, it's right there behind us. We will say ciao to Portugal and... Uh, hola. Hola to Spain tomorrow. <laughs> That's assuming that the weather's sufficient to let yeah, us catch please, the please boat. Cross Cross your fingers, we, we're catching a small taxi boat, so hopefully yeah. it won't be too windy weather tomorrow. Uh, we get a, a little boat uh, yeah. from um, Camina to uh, Aguada, or near to Aguada, and then we'll walk uh, around, and then that's it, we're in Spain. Off Crazy. Utrea. Utrea. So, um, I think that's about it for today. Uh, I don't think we've got anything exciting to tell you other than Spain tomorrow. Well, we did promise them the story of the buffs. That's true. Yeah. Okay. Have you got a buff? Any buff? Stand by. Ta-da! So we have these um, buffs, um, but they're special buffs to us because we bought them four and a half. Whenever COVID was really raging, we were in, in Oman at the time hmm. and after the initial lockdowns we, uh, we were, were let out and we were all wearing masks, being terrified and we'd started watching the videos on YouTube. So we are here in the Middle East in the midst of hot summer, not allowed to go outside. We 
looked around. We were so desperate. To we wanted some something. walking sticks, didn't yeah, we? We, we did. wanted to buy some camping, some walking gear, so that yeah. we could feel somehow connected. Yes, but to somehow what we preparing. Were gonna do. We were going to start, you know, getting in, in mm. shape for walking and stuff. And 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 we wanted to we wanted to buy backpacks. And we went to this little sports store. And there on the wall were these buffs. And we spotted the Camino. Camino. It, Camino was, it logo. was a sign. Yes. It was a real sign. And it really boosted us. And we bought them. We've taken care of them. We we didn't unpack them till we got here. No. This is their first outing, and we are so happy with them. We we refused to wear them and, until we actually had. Day yeah, I've got one another pink on one you've probably seen. We've we've had all sorts of buffs and stuff, but yeah. they were very special to us. So when the other day when I left mine. In a, at the restaurant. And even though I was very tired, <laughs> I was very tempted not to tell Tina that I'd actually left it behind. He knows what, he knew what was going to happen. He I told knew me. that she would make me go back and get it, but I, I, did. I needed to be told <laughs> to go back and get it because I really didn't yeah, want to walk all that extra to distance. Us. So that's the story of the buffs. Um, so we've had them for yes. four and a Without half years or so. Them. We've been very, because we lose everything. Um, Dude, but, he but, loses everything. I don't. But we were very careful not to lose these when we were packing up the house and moving from old man yeah. uh, back to Europe. So there you go. That's the story of the buffs. Uh, lucky Camino buffs and their first outing. Yeah, and hopefully many more outings. Um, okay. So we will see you bright and early tomorrow. We've got to be out the door by seven tomorrow to make sure we get to the boat in time. Yeah, that'd be great. And uh, and the weather report is saying rainy, rain, rain, rainy, or rain, rain, and then some wind and a little bit more rain on top of that. Yeah. But hey, that's what it is. That's that's the Camino. We're kind of hoping that we soonish we'll be able to maybe get some other um, ponchos because our ponchos have armholes so from here and all the way down it's just wet we, we didn't research ponchos or anything we, we didn't even, some... we didn't even give them a, a second thought we no. just bought a poncho yeah. and the first time we unpacked it T-Rex. we were here on the camino when it started raining and then that's we... actually not true we, we, we wore them um oh we Ireland. wore them in ireland but we, we said It'll be fine. It'll be fine. How, probably what, won't get what any difference rain. could it be anyway? It's, I don't, it's for an, an hour is definitely the same as walking up the coast. So, uh, yeah, so we desperately need better ponchos. Yeah, so that. we're hoping we can get some with sleeves. I think that's going to be, did I say it was up in Vigo, Vigo, something yeah. like that, whatever it is. Actually, it fits with next time we take a, a rest day. Yeah. Oh, Negron, that's it. I can't remember. Yeah, Negron. Anyway, we will see you tomorrow, bright and early. Until then, take good care, everybody. And thanks for watching. Thank you so much for watching. Yes, indeed. Take good care and bye-bye from the Chonky Trundlers. Bye.